In this video, we will demonstrate our structural topology design framework based on principal stress lines. This is our developed design platform prototype. It supports adding point forces and supports, creating the initial structure and topology growth. These are the material properties for size optimization, and this text box will show the strain energy of the structure in each iteration. To start with, a design domain is important. The domain is used for the finite element analysis. First, we test for the cantilever structure, which has two fixed point supports on the left and one force applied on the right. We use the point selection tool in the design platform to add the supports and the applied force. After the force and boundary conditions are well specified, we can create the initial structure. And then, we can click the Topology Growth button or using the hotkey, R, to refine the structure to a refinement level that we want. We can also change the allowable maximum volume to get a different material distribution. For example, we change from 0.005 to 0.015 here. Or inversely, we can get it smaller to 0.002. Another property is related to the manufacturing constraint about the minimum thickness that can be fabricated. We can adjust it to get a different result. If the total volume is not enough to satisfy the minimum thickness, our design platform will report and update the maximum volume accordingly. In this design platform, we can dynamically change the force or supports, and a new structure will be generated interactively. In the following, we will demonstrate some test cases. <laughs> 